Hey everybody, um, I just recorded a whole probably 10 minute session that didn't record audio um, and thankfully it didn't record audio because I was a, a sappy mess um, but um, basically today's been a really rough day um, we all found out of the passing of, of Jamie Duffy which is um, a huge blow I think to the industrial community and uh, he was a, he was a good friend of mine and uh, I'm gonna miss him greatly I've known uh, Jamie for probably eight years now and uh, he was one of the coolest guys and most down-to-earth um, people that I've ever met in uh, in the music scene and uh, I've met so many people in the music scene and you know you, th you meet all these people and you think you have connections and, and you meet new friends but you know ultimately they're not your friends and uh, Jamie wasn't one of these people, and uh, I'm going to miss him a lot. It's, it's, uh, it's hard because I've never really lost anyone I cared about before, so I'm not really sure how to take this whole thing. Um, it's really hard to... <laughs> To comprehend that I'm, I'm never gonna see Jamie again. That I'm, I'm never gonna be able to give him a high five or have a beer with him. Um, I'll never get to share share the same stage with him. Um, he was a uh, a huge inspiration to me and a huge inspiration for me even starting music. Um, I remember the very first day I ever heard Acumen and uh, it was it was like a breath of fresh air to me and uh, you know it was it was an instant love at first listen and uh, I remember the day I very first met him and uh, I'll never forget any of the times I got to hang out with him and uh, share just some some good times and you know part of me feels a little guilty that I couldn't stay in in, in contact with him as much as I wanted to um, because I own my own business and that requires a lot of attention and a lot of my time and uh, I know I probably shouldn't feel like any sort of guilt at all, um, but I do because he was one of the true friends I had in in the uh, in the music industry, and uh, and you know I kind of fell out of the loop with with contact with him because of my business, and and it sucks because now he's gone and. There's nothing I can do about it. Nothing I can do but, you know, cherish cherish the good times. And, uh, and I do. I, I always do. I always will. Uh, so, um, to Jason and all of Jamie's family and the rest of his friends, uh, my heart goes out to you. Um, know that there's someone else that's way over here on the west coast that uh, is hurting as much as you guys are and uh, I know it's not going to be easy but you know we'll, we'll all get past it somehow and uh, 
we'll all keep rocking out to uh, the IQ Crack and the Acme Nation and every other band you guys uh, were in. So, I don't know what else there really is to say. Uh, today's a really shitty day to find out a good friend of yours died. And the possibility that he probably even took his own life is is actually kind of pisses me off a little bit that he that he didn't reach out to anybody to talk to because there's always someone to talk to whether it's a friend or a family member for whatever you're going through. And uh, if he really did honestly take his life it's uh, it makes it a little more sad. It just sucks. So I'm not going to drag this out. Um, if you're watching this, Jason, hopefully you, you'll you find the courage and, and maybe inspiration to keep going. And uh, and I'll be there to continue, continue to show sport. Um, but if you don't, uh, it's understandable, and uh, hopefully the rest of the community and the rest of uh, your fans understand. Um, this sucks. <sighs> this sucks. I love you, Jamie.